Hello, Financial Future Family. Welcome back to the channel where we navigate the twists and turns of financial well-being. I'm thrilled to have you here with me, and if you haven't subscribed yet, do yourself a favor and hit that subscribe button down below it's completely free, and you'll stay in the loop with all the crucial information you need for your financial journey. Today, we're diving into a report that has some eye-opening details about the financial landscape, especially for our 32% plus community that's right, for the 71 plus million Social Security Retirement SSDI survivors, spousal, SSI, and VA beneficiaries. This report reveals a shocking reality about the purchasing power of $132 compared to $100 and it directly impacts how much more support our fixed-income beneficiaries need every month. But before we unravel all the details, I want to express my gratitude for each one of you who tunes in regularly. Your support means the world to me, and I'm committed to keeping you informed, advocating on your behalf, and helping you grab every financial opportunity that comes your way. Now, let's get into the nitty-gritty of this report. In October 2013, $100 could buy you the same goods and services as $132 in October 2023. That's a 32% increase in prices over a decade a clear indication of the escalating challenges faced by fixed-income beneficiaries. While we're looking at a 3.2% COLA for 2024, Let's remember the crucial fact that expenses on goods and services have outpaced the COLA raises. Over the past 10 years, benefits have increased by 26%, but expenses have surged by 32%, creating a significant discrepancy of 6%. This means our fixed-income community has essentially fallen behind by 6% in just a decade. It's a substantial amount that could have made a real difference in the lives of many. Now, here's where compounding and time come into play. A modest 6% increase applied to your benefit today might seem like a reasonable boost, but when compounded annually, it translates into much more than a mere $60 per month. It's about recognizing that even seemingly small percentages can make a big impact over time. I know we often discuss COLA, but it's crucial to emphasize that it should be serving beneficiaries far more effectively. The numbers clearly show that our fixed-income community is facing challenges year after year, with expenses consistently outpacing benefit increases. Before we wrap up, don't forget to hit the thumbs up if you found this information valuable. Share this video with friends, family, and on social media let's spread the knowledge and empower more people to navigate their financial futures wisely. As always, your comments, questions, and feedback are welcome down below. Stay informed, stay empowered, and until next time, take care and enjoy your day.